started drilling on our property in December of this last year, and up to this point we've drilled about 54 drill holes. Uh, we're currently about ready to produce a resource report on our initial drilling, which will include all the historic drilling plus what we've uh, done to date since the, in the last nine month period. At the same time, Rob and I have been doing a couple other activities behind the scene. We've been consolidating the land position in the Comstock, and we've created the largest foothold that anybody's ever had in the modern times in this, and all the way back to the beginning, this is the biggest foothold in this renowned mining district that's ever been held. Uh, and uh, we've also been doing some, since we had done some mining before, we've been doing some optimization of our metallurgical procedures so that this next time when we go back into operation, we're able to get the greatest amount of metal out of the ground. The price has risen so dramatically that it allows us to really look to measures to get out more of the gold and silver through our recovery process than what we were doing at the lower price. And then the third thing that, that we have been doing is drilling holes, trying to build our resource. We started uh, phase one drilling with, we knew of about 30,000 ounces of gold that were in the ground at the start of the, the phase one drilling. We planned 100 drill holes. At the point we got to 28 drill holes, we, were, we knew that we had over $100 million worth of precious metals found. When we got to 40 drill holes, which we did just a little while ago, we decided to put together a resource estimate so that it would help value the company correctly from what we found. We're continuing to drill. Uh, I anticipate that we'll have that report out on this upcoming Tuesday, and Rob will have some information out on the website on, on how to look into the resource estimate. In the meantime, we've uh, announced fabulous gold grades in some of our drill holes, and, and tomorrow morning we'll come out with an announcement that will be about the release of the resource, but it'll also have in it one drill hole that we have the single highest uh, gold assay in to this point, 1.9 ounces per ton. And we found that in our drill hole number 40. And so it's not part of the resource estimate. There are several other good holes now that we've received back that won't be part of this resource estimate but they will be part of the reserve estimate that is uh, uh, going to be coming out in about six to eight weeks worth of time and should establish us then with numbers that are backed up by economics on the reserve. And so the uh, uh, current high grade number we hit, the 1.9 ounces per ton, is worth about $1,700 per ton in today's market. And the cost to get that material out of there in, in ore like that is under $20 a ton. So it's a, a, it's a true bonanza type of mineralization that we've hit in there. We've hit this type of mineralization now several times in our drilling, and we know one of the next things that we need to do is go back and uh, detail the drilling in the area of these high-grade hits. And, uh, and, and again, with this high grade of numbers, we're not going to accept that 70 or an 80 percent recovery. We know that we're going to go to uh, use more modern technology and get those recoveries of both gold and silver over 90 percent, optimizing the process. So 